Hey guys, Trent here from How to Haven, back again with another quick tutorial, and today I'm going to show you how you can stop Windows from updating a specific driver on your device. Um, so if you have something and you don't want it to get updated automatically, this is what you can do. And before we get into this, I just want to ask if this video does help you out today, please consider leaving a super thanks or just engaging in the video in any way, as it really does help me out. But let's get right into it, and before you um, actually do this, you know, we'll go to the device manager first. But you're going to want to get the driver version that you want on your device. Now, I personally, I am just going to use the current driver version, and I don't want it to update past that. But if you want an older version, you're going to want to go and download that from the manufacturer's website. And I recommend disconnecting from the internet before you do this. And then you're going to go to Device Manager. You're going to find the device you want. So in this example, we'll use my Razer Naga. Go to Properties, Driver, hit Update Driver, and then Browse uh, the Computer and you want to find wherever you saved um, that so if you're in you know documents you can look but I don't have anything because I'm already updated to where I want to be uh, but you'll have to figure that version out for yourself but once you have the version you want you can basically go over here to the details tab look for hardware IDs now you're gonna need to find the hardware ID for your device the only two that matter are the first two and now I recommend using the second one because it's more general and you can paste it, copy it like this and you can paste it into a notepad as such. Um, once you do that, you can actually close the screen and there's two ways to now en uh, you know, enact the process of stopping Windows from updating it. If you have Windows 10 Pro, we're going to use the Group Policy Editor. If you don't have Windows 10 Pro, you have to use the Registry Editor. So if you have Windows 10 Home, you have to use the Registry Editor. And the easiest way to do that is to run a file from Microsoft that will pretty much do it for you, which I'm going to put in the link to uh, in the description of this video. So go and look for the link there. Um, and that is an official uh, file from Microsoft. But if you have Windows 10 Pro, you can do it this way. By hitting the Windows key, go to Edit, Group Policy, open that up, and you're going to get this screen, and you want to go to Computer Configuration, Administrative Templates, um, System. Once you've made it to System, you're going to go to Device Installation, hit Device Installation Restrictions, and then you're going to look for the one that says Prevent Installation of Devices that Match Any of These Device IDs. Make sure it says exactly that because you don't want anything else. Double click that. And the first thing you want to do, you're going to be on not configured, is you want to go to enabled, hit enabled. I also recommend checking this box. Uh, also apply to matching devices that are already installed because it's going to go back and it's going to look for any other devices with the same ID and it's going to uninstall the current drivers and put back the drivers that you have. Uh, after that, hit show. And this is where you're going to paste your device ID. I already have it in here, but we'll paste it, hit OK, hit Apply, hit OK again. And then I always recommend restarting your computer, but you should be good uh, and your device should not be updating automatically anymore. Anyways, guys, if this video helped you, please drop a like, leave a comment, you know what to do.